Hello Sagittarius, thank you for tuning in to my channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support and I'll send it right back to you guys. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. With that being said, let's go ahead and see what messages are coming through for you guys at this time. If you're of love and light, truth and clarity, please give me clear messages for the sign of Sagittarius, please. And thank you for messages you have for the sign of Sagittarius. Oh, you guys are in your own energy. So you guys are coming out with the temperance. Yes. Somebody is coming towards you. Someone has made a decision to come towards you. They think the world of you as well. It's like there is no one else out there like you. This is someone who has a lot of love for you. And you guys do feel this connection between this person as well. But this is someone who has not revealed the way that they feel about you. But why have you guys have decided not to not to fight for this? I'm getting that someone think someone is thinking about you constantly here and they can't get you off of their mind. They feel like when they're at work, they're thinking about you when they're whatever they're doing, they're thinking about you and they also have a lot of regrets here. They are just weighing very heavily on this person's conscience here and they feel like it's too much for them to bear and they need to just get this off of their shoulder in order to at least release this and to go on with their life because they feel like if they don't release this the proper way then there will be no moving forward in their life the issue here is that this person has way too much love for you to move forward and is really tormenting this person too it's tormenting this person because they can't even like function the way this is the type of person they're used to just working going about their day-to-day -day routine they're very structured here but you come into this person's life and you throw their entire world out of whack and now all they do is think about you and they don't like that because they're used to uh being organized they're used to conducting themselves in a particular manner but now like you have opened this person's eyes up to a whole new way of being and doing things and it's like now their entire world just revolves around you this person did some it's the fact that this person because now they will here very shortly possibly within the next two months as you guys have two 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 this person will be making the decision to come towards you because they can't stop thinking about you. They have not revealed the way they truly felt about you. They have been getting like the signs and synchronicities like wake up. You love this person. You're about to lose this person. It's time to take action towards this person. Some of you guys will be dealing with the, another Sagittarius of Pisces here a libra as well but y'all aren't forcing this connection on this person it's like okay you don't want to tell me how you feel you i mean that y'all know someone is madly in love with you you know that someone loves you as much as you love them but at the same point you're not going to force anything out of this person y'all did it's like you you played your part and it's like now you're letting it go because it's like okay I, I told you how I felt and now it's time for me to move on because I'm not going to stress over a situation with someone who can't open up and express the way they truly feel. Here in your outcome, you guys have justice and the queen of pentacles in the upright here. So someone definitely sees you as marriage material. They see you as the person that they want to spend the rest of their life with. And I'm getting that this person will be coming towards you with this offer 
for a long-term commitment so possibly proposing to you here you don't see this coming at all it's going to take you by surprise i'm definitely sensing that this is someone divinely guided this is like someone that is destined to be a part of your life someone that you're meant to spend the spend the rest of your life with they bring a lot of peace into your life that's what you love it's like that peace energy about this person like they make you feel so safe they help ground you as well um this is someone that you're gonna like you and this person will have like a happy life together you will have like a very happy life together um and i'm getting that it's like what you see is what you get out of this person so however like you two like say y'all go on a date and it's like you guys talk you joke and it's like you just really enjoy yourself with this person that's how it's always going to be like this person is not going to swish up on you i'm getting that it's like the relationship between you and this person will be very stable and it's you're going to be very content in this relationship your only issue, Sagittarius, because I'm a Sagittarius as well, is we do like that thrill to a sense. So it's like this will be something new for you. Like you guys will find yourself like throwing some sort of like like salt in the flame, you know, from time to time. But this person is going to be like, bring it back down. Like we're good. And you're, it's like they're they're actually going to help like they're going to bring a lot of stability into your life. I'll leave it at that because take it as it resonates. But definitely this person has a very peaceful, grounded energy to themselves. You guys are going to have a major decision to make um, because when they come towards you, they're definitely offering. It's not just to be there is going to be paperwork involved one way or the other i'm getting a lot of you guys like you will begin proposed to um surprisingly like it's gonna come as a surprise y'all could have like not been expecting this as soon as it happens but um you will be in like proposed to because with the justice and the queen of pentacles that's marriage strongly here. That's someone proposing to you. And you guys are just like thinking about this. Like, wow, you're, it's like you've been wanting a relationship. You've been wanting to be in a long-term relationship for some time now. But now that it's here and you're realizing like your entire life is about to change. I'm getting some of y'all are going to be like, wait a second. <laughs> Like you're excited, but you're also scared at the same time because there's no going back. But you're gonna realize like you're safe with this person and this is what you pray for. Like this is what you've been asking for. So it's like, despite like the fears that you, like right now y'all like, no, nah, I, I ain't gonna be afraid. I Yes, like you'll be excited. Don't get me wrong. But when it really hits you that your life will never be the same, it's going to be a little scary for you. Because I'm getting the main thing with you guys is control. And it's like realizing that you have to release control here. It's like always being able to do things a certain way. And now you're realizing that you're not going to be able to live your life the way that you've been doing. Like things are about to change forever because this isn't, you're not going to separate from this person. You and this person are going to be together for the long haul here. This is definitely someone that has been like divinely guided into your life. Some of y'all are realizing that y'all could have entertained those type of toxic relationships 
because you had a reason, like you would have a reason to be like, uh, you know, I'm done with it. And it's really like you guys are realizing that you actually, this person is going to awaken you to a, like a lot of things that you're going to, like they're revealing things about you that it's like you didn't really realize about yourself. That it's like y'all could have been dealing with people that were non-committal because you're non-committal to a degree here. So hear me out. So it's like you're attracting what is within you, but now you're ready for a serious relationship, but you still have like these fears that you're ne needing to deal with. And that's what you're in the process of dealing with before this person makes this commitment, this offer for a long-term commitment. Because you're needing to realize why you are attracting um, this type of energy before anyways. Okay. Sagittarius, you guys are the non-committal ones in this relationship. Oh, wow. Your overall energy is the Ten of Pentacles. You guys are about to be in like a beautiful family. It's very beautiful. This energy between you and this person. They're definitely about to bring a lot of stability into your life. And, and some of you guys will definitely end up having a child by this person. Some of y'all could also already have a child. And I'm getting that it's like their family, like this person's family is going to take your child in like they're their own. Like this, your child will be like, oh, it's making me emotional. My God, I'm not about to cry on my camera. Oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> I'm like so dramatic. I'm sorry, Sagittarius. I am a Sagittarius too, so y'all know we can be oversensitive, and that's what a lot of people don't understand about Sagittarius, that we are very deep, um, very emotional, so, and I have a lot of water placements too. Anywho, I'm definitely sensing um, this relationship that you guys are about to be in, because you're definitely about to end up marrying somebody, whoever this message is for. And especially if you guys have, like, you're a single parent here, like, their family is about to take your child in. Some of y'all have been, like, like, you're very cautious about who you allow to be around your child because you guys could have been abused as a child yourself. And it's like, you feel so safe and secure in this family dynamic here. And it's a very beautiful relationship. And I'm also getting like financial security too. There is someone, it's like right when they're ready to take action towards you, they miss their opportunity because you guys are in this whole new energy because of this person that has came into your life and swept you off your feet. And they have brought a lot of balance into your life, a lot of balance and security. Um, this person just like charged into your life and they just changed your entire world around here. Now, definitely you guys are the stubborn ones and the non-committal ones and the ones causing all the chaos in this connection between you and this person. Because I'm getting that like, this person sets you free from some like spiritual bondage that you've been in they are like the key to help set you free from this um 
they're very generous towards you as well. This person is going to love to spoil you, to take care of you. They just want to be there for you. Because they're saying that you need like some sort of support here. And they want to prove like their loyalty to you, that you can trust and depend on them. There's a lot of growth and expansion happening in your life. I'm definitely seeing you guys bossing up. It's like you have two energies here. You have like one where you're very grounded, you're like an introvert, but then you can also take on like this extrovert energy as well that helps like when it comes, cause it's like at home, you're very peaceful, you're very quiet, but then it's like um, when you're in work mode here, you have like a completely different energy you attract a lot of attention as well. You, people also find you very intimidating, but knowledge, like you're very intelligent. You you can walk that walk. You talk that talk and walk that walk. Um, but what people don't really see about you is that you're really like an introvert here. Like you truly enjoy being out in nature. You enjoy your quiet time. You don't like to be surrounded by a lot of people all the time. So it's like they see you one way, but then you're like, it's like that's only a small version of you. It's like, that's what you have to be at times but who you truly are is someone very grounded loving nurturing um you're a provider as well you take care of the people that you love you're very protective over the people that you love too someone is definitely breaking you free like this person is coming in and they're gonna help like free you whether it's financial burdens um, or just like doing things on your own. They're opening your eyes to also um, some things that you, it, it's really like you, some form of like self-sabotage self here. But they're setting you free of it where you guys won't be repeating this cycle anymore. You guys have been waiting for this justice to come into your life. Like for, and it's really regarding love because you felt like you've been disappointed time and time again. And it's like, finally, you've, you've found that connection, that person who's not going to betray you. That's why I'm getting. And allows you to feel safe to be vulnerable. I'm like, which one the I still have two more decks. Within the next few months, this is about to happen. This person is not going to give up on you. They're not going to turn their back when you listen to your intuition. You guys have been given the signs and synchro uh, synch synchronicities, the signs and messages that you need regarding this connection. Um, this person's big happy changes is your overall energy. So there are some major uh, changes that are about to occur in your life that's gonna make you very happy. Now, this person coming into your life is about to bring in a whole community with them. So it's like, if you guys are going from like being on your own, not having the support that you need regarding whatever, they're bringing in a lot of support for you. It's like an entire community that comes along with this person. And when I mean, it's going to make you very happy to be surrounded by so many people that you can trust, that you can rely on. It's going to take a major load off your back, off your shoulder. And this is what this person wants for you because they see that you don't trust a lot of people. They don't quite understand, but they know for the most part that you have been betrayed. You have gone through a lot. 
and they want to be there for you and they also want you to be surrounded by a lot of people that you can trust that you can rely on because they want to show you the way things should be what you deserve now there is someone from the past that is coming towards you and you're needing to be blunt and direct with this person not to try to be kind towards their feelings or to spare their feelings but to be very assertive when you approach this person because you want to make sure that you don't disrespect this connection that you're in with this other person you're needing to let them know that you're in a new relationship you're being asked to make sure that you set it straight, like set the record straight with this person, that you're not open, you're not available anymore because you don't want to play games with this person that you're being blessed with. So you need to let this person know you're not available and you're with someone else, you respect that person and you don't want to disrespect that person at all. So I'm saying that that's what you guys will be doing or you're being asked to do that. You're Because you're letting them know that you're going in a new direction. You're not wanting to engage in this connection anymore. You've been disappointed enough. Yes, this is the person that is meant for you. Not the one that you're disconnecting from, but you know who the person is that's meant for you. You guys already know this person. But it's just things are not moving or progressing as fast as you would like it to. But yes, this is your person. You're just needing to be a little patient here when it comes to this connection with this person. This is a very, it's happening all in perfect timing. It will be perfect timing when all of this takes place. Are some of y'all British? Or are you dating someone that's British? What was that? Harry Potter? Do some people like Harry Potter? Are you Harry Potter fans? Some of you guys, your person could be in their 40s. This person is constantly thinking about you. They're wondering how they can bring like healing into your life. They wanna take you off the market, but their approach towards this uh, relationship, they're being very strategic. Like this is a deep thinker, okay? So this person, they overthink everything. They are concerned. They're they're like concerned about some sort of drama here. This person could be getting oh, it's like they're healing. They could be getting over a loss here. They could be healing from something. And so they want to make sure that like they're strategizing. They hope that you're not exploring other options in this time of separation. Some of you guys, this is multiple messages here. So take it as it resonate because um, some of y'all could be at a distance from your person. It's like while they're mapping things out in this connection, they're taking their time. They could have like some things that they're dealing with here. This is not the person from the past um, that you're closing off to. This is someone who it's like they're going through some sort of healing here. They could have suffered some like significant loss. 
but they are thinking about you and they are about to make a decision to come towards you. Yes, this person has money too. They are financially well off. This is someone that you do value here. Y'all definitely, some of y'all are dealing with some sort of financial issues here. Um, but I'm getting like this person coming into your life is going to bring a lot of stability in every area. Y'all definitely, this person is going to come into your life and it's like the way that they treasure you, it's going to bring a lot of healing into, it's like, it's going to heal your heart. Because I'm getting that like y'all, your heart chakra has been like wounded and the heart chakra is one of the hardest chakras to heal. But this person is going to help like initiate that healing process or to just, you know, start healing your heart chakra, start healing your heart from all that you've been through. So I'm gonna leave it there, Sagittarius. These are the messages that came through for you at this time. Be sure to hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. I definitely appreciate all the love and support. You will be getting an offer from someone here for a long-term commitment. I was getting four. So possibly within the next four months for some of you guys. With that being said, take care. Hit that like button, leave a comment. This reading resonates. I definitely appreciate it.